Um, I don't really normally have superstitions, but I've had one that's kind of started like easing its way in my life. Uh, like lucky underwear thing going on. Not saying I got, I don't have just one pair. So don't think I'm that gross. I've, it's more about a certain style and brand of underwear that seem to really, really make my truck drive way better for some reason. Not really superstitious. I just like to check in with my family before I go out there and make sure everything's good at, on the home front and let them know I'm about to do, go do this crazy Monster Jam event and I'll uh, check in with them maybe at halftime or, or if I can't after, after the event's over. My competition ritual is definitely um, to try to stay calm because I have a lot of energy before a show. And I have to say, usually I try to sing a song and sometimes my uh, technician put a song on the mic for me. So that is definitely my ritual. No, no rituals or superstitions. I just kind of like to chill out, have fun with everybody and joke around and uh, just kind of keep myself loose. Well, before each event, kind of not really superstition, but I just in a routine. We have a rear main pool that's on our truck for like the power and just shuts everything off. I always make sure that that's tripped. I always make sure my fuel cap's on and I make sure all my seat belts are on, my helmet strap tight, and I'm ready to go, man. Lock me down and I'm ready. I'm not really a superstitious type person. Uh, one ritual that I do have as I'm strapping in my Monster Jam truck every time is to uh, just kind of take a little moment of silence, clear my head, and uh, say a prayer. I do, actually. Uh, I'm kind of a systematic person a little bit when it comes to that. I make sure that my helmet, or I put on, uh, let's, let's go through the, the realms, man. I get in the truck, I uh, strap my bottom belts, get my Hans on, strap the top belts, then I hook my helmet up. Then I sit back in the truck like this, get my, my gloves right over here, put my gloves on, steering wheel's got to be facing up, like, straight, even though it, it doesn't matter. Just To me, it's got to be that way. I don't know, I just have this routine that I go through. And if I get out of that routine, I feel like it's I'm just trash at that point. I gotta stay in that. Um, not really a superstition. I mean, I have, like I'll put my hat in the cab every time and it's always left glove on, right glove on, pull the helmet, make sure it's tight, click the Hans and then rip into that seat as hard as I can. And that's just the order that I do it. In terms of superstitions, I'm probably the worst. Uh, I played lacrosse and stuff through all through my life to college and stuff. so. I have so many pre-show rituals that I have to do. It's honestly, if I do one thing wrong, I mean, I'll be okay, but it's gonna change my mental. So I have to get dressed a certain way. I have to listen to certain songs. I have to put my socks on a certain way. I need to walk the track a certain way. I need to be on the track for a certain amount of time. It's, it's honestly insane what I have to do before a show, but I think it helps me perform better. So I continue to do it and I like doing it.